six. Are you available? Copy. 240 negative? Sorry. False alarm on that code red near Magnolia. Try that carpet shop off Post Alley. Thanks, 303. Copy. Dispatch, I need to run a license check on that 10 Officer Matthews, I've got a 1010 in progress. 1452 Lewis Avenue. I'm gonna need backup. Copy that. All backup Tonight, don't be late, losers. Okay, update time. You heard back from Jen yet? Um, no. I'm sure she'll reply at some point. Let me take a look at the situation. Hey, Jen, you going to the party tonight? Dude, we talked about this. Could you have any less game? <sighs> I'm no good at this. Ooh, how about... Yo, Jen, see you at the party. Let me know if I should bring handcuffs. <laughs> oh my god, you thirsty bitch. Here, let Lila the Love Witch work her magic. Okay, just don't make me sound like a loser. I said matchmaker, not miracle worker. Hey, hold on. Let me check it before you send. Too late. Would be awesome to see you there. What? I could have texted that. It's a good start. She'll text back, you'll see. You know, I don't even know if I want to go tonight. Oh, please. It's gonna be fun. You hate every party. Oh, because they're all the same. Too many people, too fucking loud, everybody's wasted. Yes, Sean, you just described a party. Well? The suspense is killing me. It's dad. He wants to know if I'm coming home after school. <sighs> Jeez, I'm not a 10 year old. He just cares about you, Sean. Anyway, you should be happy your dad's looking out for you. Oh, it's Jen saying she can't wait to see us at the party. What? Really? <laughs> yes. <laughs> Told you I would work my matchmaker magic. Hmm. So. So what should I wear tonight? A condom. Oh, ha ha. Paying plenty of attention in sex ed class, I see. Hey, lovebirds. Back from the loony bin? Shut the fuck up, dickhead. Damn, your neighbor's an asshole. Yep. Always true to himself. Man, 
We need to find a couch for your yard one day. <sighs> Ooh, careful. Last time my dad almost busted me out here. Because you were alone? Your dad wouldn't bust me. He loves me. So, you want to hit or not? Hmm. Nah. Maybe at the party. Track stars aren't supposed to smoke, you know. Yeah, sure. I'll remember this when you're begging for a spliff tonight. Speaking of weed, I got that covered tonight. What else do we need? Eric said his parents don't leave shit at the cabin, so we better make an official party list. Hey, whoa, what the hell are don't you doing? Don't move. You're my human post-it note. First, we need money for supplies, munchies, chips and dip, soda, etc. <sighs> this better wash off. And of course, we must not forget the booze. I can probably snag a six pack from Dad if he's got enough. Hey, did you ever think of maybe just sending a text instead? Hmm. All oh, right, blankets. It's gonna get so chilly tonight. You and Jen are gonna need something to snuggle under. Oh, one last thing. C O N D. Oh. oh, stop. You're out of room, punk. Is this how you see a penis? Damn, you should try and actually see one for real. You don't want to go down that road, dude. My chances of scoring tonight are probably ten times yours. <laughs> you wish. Oh, these fucking planes, man. I want to hate them, but I'll miss them so much if I move somewhere else. Shit changes so fast. I get so emo sometimes, wondering what will happen to us once we graduate. Will you still be my BFF? Will shit ever get better than 1452 Lame Avenue? Yeah, man. Friends forever. Yeah, but what happens if we go to different colleges? Or you get sick of me? Whatever. Uh, you heard of the internet? <laughs> no way distance can tear us apart. We're freaking fighters. Yeah, you're right. Best freaking fighters forever. Okay, it's getting way late and I gotta pick out my outfit for tonight. Skype me later when you're ready. Hugs. Talk to you soon. Hello, Friday night. <laughs> hey! Perfect timing. Just the sun I wanted to see. Oh. Sure, but I'm a little busy. Did you see Lila? She said we can go to the movies next week. She said- Dude, bug her, not me. You're not exactly her type. You're lucky she puts up with you. Ugh, jeez. Thanks, Pop. I feel really supported right now. You're welcome. And now we need an objective judge. That would be you. <gasps> really? Hey, no shh, fair. Shh, shh, shh. Court is in session. Judge Diaz. Presiding over the case of the last Choco Crisp. I... I have to go, uh, get ready for a party and stuff. So... Well, if you want to attend to a party and stuff, you have to earn it, Your Honor. Oh, shit. Hey, he swore. Yes, I heard Tattletale. Mm. Please, Judge Diaz, be an example to the court and society. Then you can go hook up or chill or whatever. Now, who deserves to eat this final choco crisp? 
your adorable little brother who eats about 10 bags a week, or your poor, suffering father who slaves over a hot engine to provide his family with a home and a garage? Me, me, me. Come on, Judge. Shh, 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 shh. Let him decide. Judge, the verdict, please. You're both guilty of wasting my time. Case closed. What? No fair. Dad, dad, dad. What is this? Mm. My own flesh and blood tosses me under the bus. He sucks. Okay, back to work. I hear an engine calling my name. And you better play nice together, like you always do. Yeah. I have to work in my room, too. Yeah? Don't hurry back. <sighs> okay. Let's get this party list started. It's good to be the judge. That's right. Que pendejo. Better pack for the party. I could just stay home and binge Top Gear with Dad and Daniel, but not tonight. All right, Dad. Where do you put the blankets? Thank God I don't have to take one of Daniel's. I'm sure Dad won't miss one blanket for the night. Can't believe Dad actually asked me to tag up this wall. Well, of course, he asked Daniel too. That you, Choco Thief? Yeah. Yeah. Don't get too excited, kid. You're making me nervous. Hey, 
Since you're creeping around up there, can you pass me the wrench in the top red drawer over there? Sure, can do. Um, there's no wrench here. Ah, shoot, must be somewhere else then. Take a look around. I know I left it nearby. It's a 16 millimeter reversible flex wrench. Jeez, that was definitely my plan for tonight. So, yeah. Hold on. Sam came by the garage today. Told me to tell you hi, friend. How's this leg? Well, you know, old fossils like us don't heal the way you do. Uh, remind me never to get old. Hey, it beats the alternative. Hey, I got it. I think. Nah. I need one with the black switch on it, so I can change its direction. Did you get your English midterm back? Uh, yeah. I got a B. A B? But you were so confident about the essay you wrote. Yeah, I think Mrs. Calloway is just prejudiced against Vonnegut. But Slaughterhouse-Five is amazing. Hey, you don't got to tell me. Tell her. Next parent-teacher meeting? <laughs> She's getting a piece of my mind. <sighs> prejudiced against Vonnegut. Here you go. Hmm, you should have a flex head. I can't reach that bolt otherwise. Hey, seriously, what's taking you so long? Hey, seriously, I'm not a mechanic. Come on, bring me anything, really. I'll... Is that it? Yes, this is it. Took your time about it, but you did it. I'll make a grease monkey out of you. Yeah, yeah. All right, just let me tighten this. So, finally decided to come and join your old man under the hood, huh? <laughs> Yeah, um, sure. I know it's not your thing, but you gotta learn a trade. Art, athletics, engineering, I don't care. As long as you put your heart into it. I'm trying. I just don't know what direction to go. You're only 16 years old. You've got time to figure it out. Trust me, it took me a while, too. And you happy with it? I mean, your job, living here? Of course I am. We're doing great. Maybe one day when I retire, I'll go back to Mexico, to Puerto Lobos. But until then... Ugh, oh, I've heard this one before. Hmm. I don't even know why I'm fixing you a sweet car for graduation. Well... You don't have to. I mean, it's cool. Are you sure you're my son? You don't want to visit Mexico. You don't want to have a car. I can't even get you into Rush or Santana. Are you going to ride the bus for all your dates? Like I'm going on tons of dates. Not when Daniel's cock-blocking me the whole time. He's nine. He doesn't even know what cock-blocking is. He looks up to you, Sean. Try and help him. It's what family is for. Things are kind of scary out there in this country right now. Yeah. Oh, um, by the way. Ha, I was wondering how long it'd take. You need money for the party tonight, right? Ah, 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 shh. Just be honest with me. No bullshit. Are you using this money to buy alcohol? Weed? Um, 
I mean, yeah, probably. But we'll be partying at a house and nobody's driving home. I swear. Well, everybody's got to get home somehow. But yeah, you and Lila better not get in any car with somebody who can't walk straight. Holy shit, 40 bucks? Really? Yeah, why not? You did a good job on the lawn. Plus, I appreciate that you didn't lie to me. Thanks, Dad. Just be careful. That's all I'm asking for, okay? I know what kind of crazy shit kids can get into. When you were my age, did you party a lot? <laughs> Sorry. What happens in Mexico stays in Mexico. Now get out of here before I change my mind about that cash. And keep an eye on Daniel while you're home, would you? All right. Thanks, Dad. Hey, hey, hey. Not so fast, Shawnee boy. Don't you think your papito deserves a hug? Ugh. Okay, have fun, but not too much. I won't. Promise. Bye. Love ya. I love you too, hijo. I bet Dad had a pretty wild teenagehood, even though he won't tell. Lila's so hyped up for tonight. Better hurry. I can spare a few bucks for next week's pizza night. That'll do. Bet there's gonna be a keg at the cabin. Okay, better take that instead. Cross that off the list. Drinks down, food to go. I hope there's also, like, real food at this party. Looks like I got everything. Better pack it all up. Huh. 
<sighs> Not sure Daniel was ready to be an uncle yet. Lila provides the weed tonight. I better be ready. Man, I so don't want to work this weekend. Sorry, Lila. I'm just not a selfies kind of guy. Okay. Don't be a stalker, Sean. Man, this is taking forever. Oh my god. The internet was a mistake. Lila will survive if I take five to practice my drawing. I should take a good look at the subject before drawing. Cool. I think I'm ready to draw this. Lighting is nice. It's been a while since I've sketched my room. Rough looks cool, but messy. Should I keep going? Time to take the pen, dude. My room almost looks cool on this. Not an easy task. <laughs> Good job. Finally, ready to go. Time to Skype Lila on my laptop. Lower boy, just give me a minute. Gee, where did I put the... Mm, hold on. <sighs> okay, hi. Did you get everything on your hand list? It's all in my backpack, yeah. Dad hooked me up with some cash, so we're set for the night. In case we need anything else. Or if you and Jen need anything else. Ooh la la. <sighs> 
Okay, serious talk. What are you gonna say to Jen tonight? I don't know. Whatever. Do I need to practice? <sighs> I've seen you in action. Yes. You're totally into her, right? Duh. Why do you think I'm freaking out? She's so super cool. You're super cute. Just be yourself. That's why she's Sean, into you. Sean! I'm done, look! I made zombie blood. It's, um, corn syrup and food coloring. Hey. Hi, <sighs> Lila. Get out of my room, Daniel. I was just... Come on, man. Just, uh, Just bugging the uh, shit out what? of me again after I told you to knock? Uh, yeah, what? I know. <sighs> anyway. Sean, you're an asshole. What's your problem? <gasps> but... I want to see zombie blood if you don't. Sorry, sorry. I'll make it up to him. He knows I can be a dick. I'm just stressed out about tonight. Oh, please. We're gonna have so much fun. Maybe tonight's the night... Don't jinx me. Jinx? I'm your lucky charm, bitch. <laughs> okay. So when are you coming over? I just have to hit up the momster for the car keys and hope she doesn't make me lie too much about the party. I'm already in trouble from last time. This time, don't get caught. Let me see that drawing. This might be my masterpiece. Well, yeah. It's my portrait. Ooh, shit. Jen just posted her outfit for tonight. What? On her wall. You should check it up. It might get your attention. Hey, are you listening to me? Um, you know something called multitasking? <laughs> That's a girl thing, no? Whoa. Her hair. Whoa, indeed. I told you she was super into you, man. What's her profile picture got to do with me? Huh. You will see. No reaction? No like? No nothing? Hey, uh, I don't appear like a stalker or something. <laughs> okay. Okay. Touché. Why is Derek Anderson all over Jen's profile? <sighs> He's an asshole. Better be nice. They're like best friends, stalker. Really? Oh. In that case, I'll spare him. <laughs> Dude, she already likes you. Oh my God. Don't blow it. Hold on, okay? Something's going on outside. What do you mean? Hey! Look at my shirt, asshole! What's the big deal? It's Halloween! Don't ever touch my brother! You hear me, Brett? Fuck you, Diaz. He got his fake blood shit all over my shirt! Look! I told you, it was an accident! You better leave us alone! Oh yeah, go hide in your dad's garage. Pussies. You think you own the block? Step back. He didn't mean it. He's a fucking kid. He's a fucking retard. What? What did you just say? You heard me, bitch. Don't ever touch him again. Or what? You're gonna get your daddy? Hey, asshole. I don't need him to protect me from you. Oh, you wanna go? Oh, yeah, <laughs> motherfucker? Then go back to your own country. <laughs> Whoa! Sean, you hit him! Get inside now! Sean! You're dead meat, bitch! <laughs> You and your whole fucking family are going to jail, losers! Uh, what's going Fuck on? me! Daniel, get over here! Sean, is he hurt? Okay, okay, step away. Now! Calm down, officer! Shut up! And step back! On the ground! Now! 
Hey, wait! This guy was He's starting beating me. up my little brother! Now! Hands behind your head! Sean! This is fucking bullshit! Oh no. Sean, what's Get happening? On the ground. Sean. Dad! We didn't do Sean, anything! Sean, be quiet! I swear! Off Dad. Shot, listen. Oh, I'm sorry, Dad! Daddy! Just be quiet! You wanna go home? They're good kids, officer. Don't move! I'm sure they didn't do I anything! I said don't move! We didn't Daniel, do anything! It's gonna be alright! On the ground! No, man. We can't stop here. We gotta keep going. No pouting, okay? Come on. But... But... My feet really hurt. These shoes suck. And we've been walking for four days. What? Only two. Don't even try that shit. And my back hurts from sleeping under that stupid bridge. Yeah, so does mine. I was there, too. Just... Knock it off. I hate it when you act like this. This is how people camp in the woods. It's not like being... being at home or... or in your room. This is a... a real adventure. Right? So... come on. Let's hit the trail. Seriously. Where's Dad? Daniel, come on. We gotta go. Why isn't Dad with us, Sean? Doesn't he want to go camping too? 
Yes, but I told you that he can't. I told you, okay? Okay, but I am so sick of walking. I just wish I was back in my room. I know, I know. Hey, at least we don't have to go to school on Monday, right? Yeah. Look, um, everybody's gonna be so stoked when they find out how far you walked. Really? Really? I bet Dad would be too. Do you think we walked, like, maybe a hundred miles? Probably two hundred. Feels like it. Ooh, awesome possum. But next time, Dad better get me a good pair of shoes, like yours. Dude, a Bigfoot doesn't need good shoes. I'd rather be a wolf. Ow! We could be wolves. Yeah. Yeah, that, that works. Just work on that how. Hey, you know what? Let's see if you can walk the whole way without complaining once. Huh? Uh, like, you don't whine too? I don't whine. I... I tag your ass and no, run. You're it. No way. Not fair. Whatever. Okay. I'm a zombie and I'm gonna eat you. Blah! Are we there yet? Dude, stop. You know what? You're not allowed to say that ever again. Yes, sir. You'll be the first one to know when we get there, okay? I'm tired and hungry too. Listen, this looks like a perfect place to camp out. I bet we're not the first people to stay the night. It's creepy. There's nobody out here. We didn't even see any cars. We're gonna camp here. I'll look out for you. Hmm, 
I see something. What do you find? Check it out. There's a chunky chocolate crisp bar on the dashboard. Yeah, I see it. You know I love Choco Crisp Bars. I haven't had one in a million years. Yeah, right. More like two days ago. Come on. Can we please, please, please get one when we stop next? Please? Let's take this one. Nobody's gonna miss one single Choco Crisp Bar. Really? I would. This is for a good cause. Oh, uh, almost. I uh, got it. Mm -hmm. Yes. Boom. Choco Crisp is ours. Now we have dessert. Come on. Let's beat it. Now we can see where we are. Whew. There's a river nearby. A river? Are we gonna go swimming? No. Duh. It's way too cold for your skinny butt. Okay. There must have been a big ass storm. Ooh. Landslide. Doesn't sound good. Should be fine. I don't know, I guess they missed that car. What if the owners come after us for the Choco Crisp? And they're hunters! You're too little to hunt. We're cool. Dad showed me how to read these I when I was eight. Get lost. Daniel, check out this mark on the tree. What is that? Graffiti? Not exactly. It's called a trailblaze, and people used to put them up to give directions. Like GPS? <laughs> yeah, sure. Just slightly more ancient. Awesome! Let's follow it. Only Dad was here. Stop thinking about that. Get over. Sean, look. Gross. Bro, chill. Come on, Daniel. Don't look at it. It's not fair. No. No, it's not, Daniel. Jeez, I can't walk anymore, Sean. Please don't make me. I won't. You did great today. For real? <laughs> of course. Come on, let's go back in camp. We'll head out tomorrow. <sighs> okay, dude, you have to use the bathroom? No. It smells real bad. No shit. Seriously? You better go now. I don't have to go. Jeez. Can I just pee on a tree? Okay. But you'll have to go on your own later. Stop treating me like a baby. Man, people don't even read the signs. Sean? Look how big these trees are. Eh, that's only because they need the sun. Besides, they'll protect us from the rain. What if they don't? What if they... Uh, attack us?
aren't you Mr. Minecraft? I thought you loved the forest. I watched you build giant cities out of logs. I did. I built the biggest cities ever. Ooh. I can use my axe to chop up some wood. Then we can build a secret base. <sighs> well, sounds like you're ready for the woods. Dad always knew exactly where to go. He was a living compass. <sighs> well, sounds like you're ready for the woods. Lead the way. Whoa, that place is huge. Yeah, it's kind of cool. I don't think Daniel understands what's going on. I can't tell him the truth now. I just can't. Man, what are we doing out here? Where are we going? Hmm. Huh. The river must be a bit further. Let's take a look around. Hey, Sean, I found bears. We don't have much. Can this I is better than please? nothing. Not these ones. Come on. I'm starving. One won't hurt. Yeah, it could. You better listen to me. We don't have much. This is better than nothing. I'll leave that to the zombies. Picnic and hiking site. Well, I bet nobody comes out here to picnic anymore. <laughs> well, that's good for us. No camping? Uh-oh. Don't worry. Nobody's gonna find us out here. Do not feed or disturb the animals? What? What kind of animals? Like bears? Or coyotes? Or... More like squirrels, rabbits, critters. Just don't bug them and they won't bug us. They're way more scared of us than we are of them. Unless they're angry or hungry. Okay, come on. Don't freak yourself out. Let's go. Now we know what not to do, right? I guess. I don't like it here. People write some stupid shit sometimes. <sighs> Feels so good to sit and not walk. Man, this bench is like a rock. I miss our couch. We're not that desperate yet. Man, if I had a wooden axe, we could build a city out of this forest. <sighs> Damn. I'm so tired. Feels like we're walking nowhere. How am I supposed to take care of us out here? I don't even know what happened back there. To that cop. Or Danny. How can that be? Whoa. Look at that. 
Yeah. So cool. Never seen you get so jacked up over a nice view before. So? I've never seen anything like this. Never, ever! Yeah. I guess you haven't. I remember when... Dad... I wish Dad was here with us. Well, thanks. Not cooing off anymore? Yes, you're super cool. But I just wish the family was together. At home. It'll be cool to watch a movie and get a pizza and eat ice Dude, cream. Dude, stop. I told you we have to keep going. We'll see Dad later. And right now, it's just you and me. Okay? Yeah. It's our park. We can do whatever we want. That's right. So, we better go build a, a secret base so we can hide out for the night. Are you ready? Yes. I can build anything. We just have to find some cool blocks around here and be careful of creepers. Okay. Let's go. Oh, yeah? I'll give you ten seconds to find a hiding spot, and then you're toast. Turn around so I can hide. And don't look. One, two... Come on! You're cheating! No peeking! One... Come on! You're cheating! No peeking! One... Two... Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I'm coming. Okay. Where are you? Now, where could Daniel be? <laughs> Knowing Daniel, he shouldn't be hard to find. Seriously, where is he? Ooh, I see you, Daniel, but you don't see me. Here you are. <laughs> you almost didn't find me. Yeah, we're in a giant forest. The best hiding spot. Ah, 
I don't know how I still remember these. I hope the animals out here aren't hungry. Daniel, come check this out. What? What? Be quiet. He'll take off. Ooh, raccoon. He's so cute. <laughs> that raccoon will tear us apart. Let's go, bro. Here, kitty kitty. Here, kitty kitty. Aw, that raccoon must be starving. Raccoons are way smarter than us. He'll find more food. What if this raccoon is related to the... to the one on the road? Hey, don't think about stuff like that. Maybe they were brothers. Like us. Makes me sad. Stop. They're just raccoons. Shit. I should have helped him. So much for the big bro. Oh, man. You okay? No. I don't like this place. I don't want to stay here. I know, Daniel. I get it. But we won't be here long. I promise. Sean. I'm tired. Do we have to keep walking? No. I'm tired too. Plus the sun is going down, so... We better find our camping spot for the night. Is that cool with you? I'd be such a shit father. I wish I was big like you. Hey. I could do a lot Daniel! More. You hear that? Is that a bird's nest? Oh, yeah. They're everywhere out here. At least they have a home. Come on. We're too big for a nest. Got you. <clears throat> Phew, thanks. I have no idea where we are, what I'm doing. It's too quiet. like a cave. Kind of, kind of spooky. No. Actually, it's kind of perfect. 
for what? For us, man. We're gonna stay in there? I don't know. Uh, come on, Daniel. Look, this could be our secret base. We could fight off any skeletons or creepers with some good traps. Cool. In that case, we definitely need to get a fire going first, right? Right! Yes! Uh, so what do we need? Uh, you know, shit to make a fire. Um, twigs, branches... Are you sure we can do this? Who can stop us? Nobody. <sighs> okay. Let's unpack. Finally. Coming! Hey, Sean, let's have a race. Whoever finds three logs is the winner. Cool? Okay. You're brave to challenge me. So let's do it. No way you're gonna beat me. I wish no. Yes, here's number two. Okay, lazy. Go find some wood. Now this is perfect. Three. Nice and dry. Hmm. That's enough for a toasty fire. If I let him beat me, he'll be happy. All right, how much you got? It's all there. Yeah, okay. That should be enough for the night. <laughs> See, told you, I won. All right, we have a little time to explore before we light up the fire. Cool. I'll go check the river. Man, this place is like our own giant camp. We should catch some fish for dinner. Shit, those are bear claws. I'm not going to tell Daniel. 
Not today. Stop moving so much. Feels good to focus on something after all that shit. If Dad was here, he'd catch every fish. Time to take the pen, dude. Ooh! We can yell as much as we want! Cool. I think I'm ready to draw. Drawing starts by observing, like your teacher used to say. Dad gave me the sketchbook. He was so fucking awesome. Ruff looks cool, but messy. Should I keep going? This almost looks like a peaceful memory. Almost. I don't get it. I won't skip. Watch me. <laughs> Dude, come on. That's a boulder, not a rock. Here, you need a flat rock. Hold it like this. Look at my hand. Boom. Okay, I get it. My turn. Hold it with your thumb and finger, and spin your wrist when you throw. Not bad. Give it another try. Uh, so close. Try again. You've almost got it. Uh, man. You're getting into the zone. Don't give up now. Oh yeah, that was awesome. I think you're ready for the Olympic stone skipping team. He thinks we're just going on a trip. I can't imagine when he'll find out what really happened. I ran into a web like that when I was a kid. Oh, you Ew. wanna challenge me? Behold my sword. Uh, who are you? Who are we fighting? Skeleton with flame arrows? Watch out! Oh, close call. Now it's our turn. Ah, right into a scroll. We are awesome. Damn right. Thanks for having my back. Now that is a big web. <laughs> You're safe, little bro. 
Spiders hibernate in the fall. Good. I remember when you pushed me into that web. Hey, that was a long time ago. You got me back, right? Yeah, well, you screamed when you saw that blasted spider. <laughs> so funny. Yeah, ha ha. <laughs> At least they won't bug us tonight. <laughs> Get it? Uh, no. I'm digging the spot. Careful. Don't want to wake up covered in ants tomorrow. We could build a really cool fort here, I bet. We've been walking for so long. I wonder how far we are from Seattle. Eighty-six? Damn, that's ancient. Check this out, Sean! Whoa! Nice view. You can see so far. Wait, I'm coming. It's beautiful. Pretty amazing, huh? See? It's not so bad here in the forest. Hey, look at those clouds. What do they look like to you? I don't know. Cotton candy? That's it? Cotton candy? I don't know. What do you see? A dragon. What? Where? Okay. There's the tail. And the horns. And the fangs. And the smoke coming out of its mouth. Oh, I see it. It's awesome. a giant douchebag. <laughs> oh, yeah? Where? <laughs> right here. <laughs> right here, huh? All right, and I know. We're cave people now. Time to make fire. We make fire. Can I help? <laughs> yep. 
You have a big mouth like me, so come on. Blow. Yes! Dude, don't blow it out. Sorry. Sorry. I wanted to do it like a movie. Oh, nice. It's warming up. I wish we had more. I know. Me too. Uh... I'm ready for dessert. <laughs> Go ahead. Mm, do you want a piece? Ah, uh, I'm good. You eat it. I'm the judge now. Not you. So you can't have a piece anyway. Okay. <laughs> Figures you try to get revenge, Judge. Hey, I want a new trial. Too late. Court closed. Mmm. -hmm. Mmm. So good. I wish we had a cheeseburger and a milkshake like yesterday. Dude, that shake was so good. Can't believe we found a diner on the way out here. <laughs> I want another one. I know. We'll get you one. Promise. You okay, buddy? Yeah. Feels good to sit down. Sean? Are you mad at me for what happened with Brett? I don't remember everything. We got in a fight. Did you kick his ass? Yeah. But nobody won. It's not like the movies, Daniel. Look, I found the
It's not quite full yet, wolf boy. Do you think there are werewolves for real? Dude, we are the wolves. Ow! See? Ow, ow! Ow, ow, ow! Ow, ow, ow! Ow, ow, ow! Ow, ow, ow! We're almost broke. How do we eat tomorrow? <sighs> I am so over chips. Still no reception. Of course. I'm bored. Sean, can I play Mustard Party on your phone? Please. No reception, so go for it. Yeah, thanks. Oh, I'm so trying to beat your score. <sighs> Aw, come on. Almost. Almost. What? No! I was so trying to beat your score. You wish. Stupid phone. I could really use a smoke. I'm so tired. Oh, you look tired. Ready to crash? Uh, I think I need to go to the bathroom. I knew it. Okay, if you have to pee, then go. You want me to come? No, I'm not a baby. Dude, not that close. We have to sleep here. I wasn't. I was trying to find somewhere to go. Sean, I heard something. I swear. Yeah, it's a forest. There's a lot of critters out there. Scared you might pee on them? Shut up. I didn't. I think we earned some serious rest. I could sleep forever. Not on this ground. Ugh. Better than freezing out there, right? Way better. Now we have a real fire. And a secure base. You did awesome today, Daniel. Really? Hell yeah. Yeah, you're like a... a real wilderness expert. Um, that's cool. Why won't stay open, Sean? Sleep tight, bro. Daniel? Hey, bro, wake up. Huh? Sean? What happened? Where's Dad? It's okay. He, he just had a bad dream. That's all. Sh Sean? Where... Where are we? Right here, in the park. 
Remember our amazing fire? Um, yeah. Are we okay? We're, we're fine. I'm right here. Don't worry. Okay, I won't. As long as you're here. Go, go back to sleep. You need your rest. But I might have another scary dream. You won't. I'm here. Just, just close your eyes. Thanks, Sean. I'm glad you're here. Good night, Daniel. <laughs>